How does my winning of the Nobel Prize affect Hopkins? It brings all of these nice people here to see us all. <laughs> um, it's, uh, I mean, it's certainly a, a, an honor to, to share with all of my colleagues here. I mean, one of the things about being at Hopkins is it's such a collegial uh, group of people, and we've had interactions with a number of people. And um, the fact that I came here um, and uh, you know, arrived here about 12 years ago, and I was really focused on fundamental curiosity-driven science. We had just uh, developed um, a mouse model. Um, but really coming here into the setting uh, where you have so many uh, people thinking about clinical questions really changed my, uh, my research into a much more uh, clinical kind of direction. Um, and so uh, I'm really grateful uh, to the Hopkins community for, you know, whenever I uh, make a phone call, uh, people answer my phone call. Uh, we started a collaboration just yesterday with, the, with another group, or just last week with, the, with another group, uh, to try and uh, sort of move forward some of these uh, clinical connections. Uh, so that really has been uh, wonderful for me, uh, and, I, and so I'm happy to share that with everyone.